Hey guys, what is up? It is me, Pager here, once again with another video on The Flash Season 4. So just a couple of quick things before we jump into the meat and potatoes of this video. At the end of the video, I will be starting a giveaway for a Funko Pop and a DVD or Blu-ray of your choice. So it can be a DC TV show season, such as The Flash Season 2, Season 3, Arrow Season 5, anything like that. Or it can be a film, so it could be any DC film you want. So Wonder Woman, Just uh, not Justice League yet, uh, like Suicide Squad, Man of Steel, BBS, anything like that. So yeah, stick around until the end of the video to find out how you can enter that. And the second thing is that I actually have started a Discord server. If you saw my community tab a couple of days ago, you would have seen me link it, but this is the first time I'm mentioning it in a video. So my Discord server will be linked in the description below. If you don't know what Discord is, maybe Google it, but it's basically just like sort of like a, a server where you can chat and stuff like that. Really interesting. Definitely go over there and have a look and see if you want to converse. There's also, there's already like a decent amount of people over there. So the more the merrier. So yeah, the link to that Discord server will be linked in the description down below. So the recent Arrowverse crossover, which is obviously Crisis on Earth X, featured parallel universes, evil versions of our heroes, new superheroes from other Earths, two weddings, which was like one was much worse than the other. And of course, there was a pretty big death. Oh, and Nazis. Lots and lots of Nazis. But one other thing that was introduced, or should I say a person that was introduced, was a mysterious female character who quickly appeared, spoke to Barry, fangirled out over the wedding, and then just sort of left. Now, as I said, this was a mysterious character, and I'm not joking when I say this. She was actually billed or credited on the show as Mystery Girl. So yeah, she is definitely one mysterious girl. Now, the actress who played this mystery girl is known as Jessica Parker Kennedy, and recently she spoke to Bustle.com about this role and also confirmed that she would be returning this season at some point, which is a big reveal because no one was really sure if she was coming back or not. Now, this is what she said to Bustle.com. I'll be around. You'll see me at least one more time, I can tell you that. You'll see me again on the show and things will make more sense. Now, Jessica also was asked about being on set and hiding that identity from the, uh, the you know, the, the various cast and crew around her. And this is what she had to say about that. Because on set, all the actors are like, who are you? What's going on? What character are you? And I just have to be like, I don't know. And also, when she was asked whether she was either of the two characters we will be talking about after this, she just called them interesting guesses, which I guess is pretty interesting. Now, the conversation that she and Barry have is a pretty awkward one, for Barry at least. She seemed to be swept up in the event, but yeah, for Barry, sort of awkward. But that conversation did just heavily hint to the girl, or th to this girl, knowing of this event and its significance. So it did definitely scream like time travel to a large contingent of the viewing audience. Now, due to this, many predictions and theories have popped up around this mystery girl and who she could possibly end up being. The first one, and the one I believe is most likely going to happen, is of course, as you can tell by the title, Dawn Allen. Now, Dawn Allen is the daughter of Barry and Iris, but she also has a twin brother called Don, who is the father of a fan favorite character. Some of you might know of him. Uh, he's just called Bart Allen. Now, in the comics, Dawn is born in the 30th century, following other events which we don't really have to get into now. Now, both she and her brother Don inherited speed from their father, Barry, but not to the level he had it. Like, they only had a fraction of his speed. Due to their environment in the 30th century, Dawn, along with her brother, kept their powers pretty much hidden until later on when Wally West, their cousin, decided to use their abilities for good and became known as the Tornado Twins. Obviously, if this was in the TV show, Wally would be their uncle. Now, one interesting thing from the comics is that Dawn and Don never knew their father, Barry. So this could be one reason why this mystery girl is so excited at the wedding. Not just because she is witnessing her parents' wedding, but because she is actually interacting with her father, which she might not have been able to do beforehand. But then again, that would only work if they went with the whole Barry and Iris have their children in the 30th century route, and I have a feeling they probably won't go with that. Just a feeling. Unless they go with something where, you know... Uh, Dawn and Don are born in, you know, current day, in like the next couple of years, but Barry possibly dies before Dawn and Don are at, uh, at an age where they would, you know, uh, be able to remember their father, unless they go down that route, but I don't know if they would go down that route or not. The other option is that she is actually Dawn's daughter, which would make her the granddaughter of Barry and Iris, and that character is Jenny Ognatz. Now, Jenny actually has ties to another group parading around at the moment in the Arrowverse, and that is the Legion of Superheroes, who are sort of a focus in this season of Supergirl. In the comics, she is known simply as XS on the Legion, so the letter X and the letter S. 
However, that's on Earth 38, and this mystery girl's next appearance will be on The Flash on Earth 1. So it could still be Jenny, I just don't think they will tie her to the Legion, but then again, it could just be the Earth 1 Legion, and they just don't won't show us any members or anything like that, but we'd have to wait and see, I guess. And once again, that would have to revolve around whether Barry and Iris had their children in the 30th century, which would allow their granddaughter to be born around that same time and become a part of the Legion. So really time travel to the future plays a big part in, I guess, Jenny being a part of it if they want to tie her to the Legion. But let me know in the comments section down below, who do you think this mystery girl is? Do you think it's Dawn Allen? Do you think it's Journey Ognatz? Or even just some random waitress? Do you think this could be a massive throw off and this character isn't Dawn Allen or Jenny Ognatz and she just is a big fan of weddings or maybe like knows Barry from somewhere? I don't know, let me know in the comments. And do you think she will be from the distant future, say the 30th century? Or do you think she will only be from like the near future? So like, you know, 20 or 30 years from the future. Let me know in the comments section down below about that as well. But now let's get on to the giveaway. As I said, it is for a Funko Pop and a DVD or Blu-ray of your choice from either like a DC TV show or a movie. So all you have to do to be in the running to win that giveaway is like the video. That's the first step. Be subscribed to the channel and answer this question in the comment section down below, which is what is your favorite moment from DC TV so far this season? So that can be from any of the TV shows so like Arrow, Flash, Supergirl, Legends. Your favorite moment from any of those shows, just pick one and leave that as your answer in the comment section down below, as well as leaving a like and subscribing to the channel to be in the chance to win that giveaway. But thanks for watching guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video. As I said, uh, do all that to enter the giveaway, as well as being sure to uh, check out my Discord server. It will be linked in the description below. Hopefully I see a decent amount of you coming over from this video over to that server. So yeah, until the next video guys, I'll catch you later. Goodbye.